I could have the most brilliant thing right now, or I could have a pile of garbage on this SD card. Sick, we got a building. Oh, cool, we got a reflection. What if we had a person walking through? I'm Josh Katz, I'm a photographer, YouTuber, skateboarder. They're not into it. I made my YouTube channel when I was nine. For the first six years of my channel, I didn't say one word to the camera. It was truly just me skateboarding. My computer is like right outside, tilted the computer around, pointed it out the window, clicked record, ran outside really quick, did a skateboard trick, and then ran back in. And that was, that was the first YouTube video. Now, I've actually phased out skateboarding entirely. I now just do photography videos. The way I view my photography is like, it doesn't have to be good. And of course, I love it, and I try my hardest for it to be the best that I can make it. But my thing is YouTube and like teaching photography and making videos about it. So this is just like a passionate thing. You know, like, I don't feel like I have to do this. I also love it. My YouTube just consists of a lot of photography tutorials for beginners. How's it going, guys? I'm Josh, and welcome to the Ultimate Beginner's Guide to Outdoor Photography. So if you've never picked up a camera before, I always walk you through some kind of complex concepts that I just try to make it really easy. Set your shutter speed. Another word for this is exposure. It's more important to go out there and realize, oh, like I, it's not that hard to take a beautiful photo. Turn your camera camera on autofocus. You're going to be focusing the shot before every single photo you take. So much of my audience is just full of creatives, people who are making music, they're artists in some, some kind of sense, uh, they're skateboarders, they're photographers, they're both. If I started doing what I was doing on YouTube back then, now, no one would watch it. I feel like now people are like, yeah, it's a sick business, you gotta do digital media marketing. I'm like, mm, it was none of that. But I did this when, for the most part, no one was really doing it. And as a result, I had that opportunity to grow. All my buttons are buttoned, I think I'm ready to do this. Around my sophomore year of college, a lot of really cool brands started flooding in. GoPro, to Boosted Board, to I did a year-long thing with Mountain Dew and Axe. Since then, it hasn't really stopped. Kind of handles like a smartphone, honestly, with the pinching and zooming. Building up relationships with all the camera companies. They're letting me borrow gear, which is insane. I still ask myself, how is this happening? This is the best one on the market right now. Being an influencer, if you will, it's about riding a wave. It's still just fleshing out what this creative space contains and what I can do, what I want to do. I don't know where I'll be in a few years, but probably doing something bizarre and unanticipated on the internet, hopefully in the photo and or skateboarding space. Oh! <laughs> I saw that coming from a mile away.